Hello out there, Grandmistress of Shadow Style JR here, and welcome back to XCOM 2 War of the Chosen Rookie Iron Man, although part of that title is no longer technically accurate because we have no Chosen to war with. Last time, we got a Supplies mission and a Gorilla mission that we took care of back to back while we were waiting for people to get healed up, but now my top people are all in proper uh, order and health. So, uh, let's go. Let's go say hello to an old friend of ours, shall we? Operation Regal Beast. Objective, investigate the signal. We've triangulated the Crash Sky Ranger's original point of departure. Energy readings in the area are spotty, but there are definitely signs of life down there. Shadow Chamber is telling us that there are vipers, but also an enemy unknown. If you've ever played Vanilla XCOM 2, you probably know what this is. Avenger plotting new course. Listen up, people. I'll be personally taking the lead on this operation. We're looking for someone. One of the finest minds to ever serve XCOM. I don't know what we're going up against, but we know she's out there. And we're not gonna let anything stand in our way. Commander, I would strongly advise you have our forces equip the specialized weapons we recovered from the field. Their unique capabilities may prove invaluable on this mission. Good point, Doctor. Let's gear up. I would agree with you on, on that, uh, except for... I would agree with you on that, Tygen, except for one tiny little problem. We have better weapons. Alright, so... Could bring... Let's see what we got here. We got our Ranger Shoe, we got our Sharpshooter Kefla, we've got uh, Cereza here, arguably our deadliest specialist. I could bring in our other specialist here. We got, and we got two Rangers, I normally like bringing two Rangers, I could bring in Lewis. Honestly, I'm going to be playing for full assault now, so having three rangers on here actually seems like a pretty good idea. Till the items. Weapons. Armor. Alright, let's load everybody up here. We've already got Keflo with the uh, hunter weapons that she needs to have. Let's give her one of the Wraith suits. And something that we're going to need to live off of here is DOT, damage over time. Why? You'll see. So, Dragon Rounds for you. I like, I like the Mystic, but at the same time, we do have this. Let's see. 8 to 10, bonus critical damage 3, clip size 4, bonus action chance 20. And she got Serial with Mystic. Clip size 8 here. AM 25, plus 20. And does four damage on a miss, on a miss shot. Oh, 
when I find myself in times of trouble. There's one decision method that I live by. And that is the law of random generation. So we're gonna go on a D20. One through 10, Disruptor. 11 through 20, Mystic. 11 precisely, it's the Mystic. We got Madama Butterfly. And like I said, I'm going for, I'm gonna go for uh, DOT here. So, let's get ya. Did I sell my, no I didn't. Venom rounds. And just in case, for a little extra defense, I'm gonna give you the hell weave. Take the Wraith suit. You are going to take the Arashi. And the Katana. And I need to have a little bit of defense on my side, so I'm going to give you the meme, the Mimic Beacon here. Lewis. You can take the disruptor. I'm going to give you a war suit. With the Hellfire projector. And for your weapon, take EI Jutsu. And you, I'm not going to build all that much for DOT. I'm going to build you for dealing as much damage as possible. So take some talent rounds. Now. You. Bradford, you can also take a hell weave. give you the other war suit. Actually, no. I'm going to give you the raid suit. And for your weapon... Yeah, go ahead and take the Hunter's Axe. Technically, the Fusion Blade is better, but I, I want to have them. Cassandra... Take a war huh. suit. Because what is it good for? Hellfire projection. That's what it's good for. You. Your two uh, weapons. You are going to take the other dragon rounds. And my favorite grenade. We are kitted out for a good time, so let's roll. In position to drop. Operation Regal Beast. And it should be noted that this particular mission and what we're about to find down here is one of the predominant reasons why this is a rookie Iron Man and not, say, veteran 
Commander, or definitely not Legend. Because I actually want my alien foes to, you know, die at I some point. continually monitoring the energy signatures we detected near the target site. Possible subterranean activity detected. Strong interference blanketing the area. Sensors are unable to penetrate the rock face. We still have a steady read on Balin's signal, however. I would advise extreme caution, Central. Biological readings in this area are erratic. In addition to several species of alien... Hold on, Doctor. We've got something. The data must be preserved at all costs. Let's hurry! Take this and find Redfoot! It's her. Unfortunately, our friend never made it to the evac point. I had hoped to meet my predecessor under less extreme circumstances. Still, I have tracked her signal to an area not far ahead. Good. Lead the way, Doctor. Keep your heads down. I was just about to say something like that. Species, there's something different about these creatures. They appear almost underdeveloped. Perhaps an earlier stage of growth or some sort of precursor organism. Just as long as they're not bulletproof. Oh, I'm pretty sure they're not. Start this party right. Fighting hands. There is no more fighting. If you need to start out, you know, I do have to wonder. Or is it the aliens that put up the pipe, the flaming pikes with human skulls on them? I will watch. Or was it Dr. Fallen that did that? Central, I have managed to restore portions of Dr. Fallen's personal research logs. I will begin patching through what I can. Snacks. So many snacks. Bad boy. 
We got snakes for days, snakes for days, snakes in all their snaky ways. Snakes for days, snakes for days, snakes with all their snaky ways. Vipers crawling from the walls. It's insane, oh holy balls. up here. I really wish Cassie had more mobility. Also that background roars kinda hurt my ears a bit. Those vipers are carrying bolt casters. I have rerouted the outgoing signal. The unit must have been damaged during whatever conflict occurred here. The complete message is coming through now. An extreme biological hazard is present throughout this area. Genetically enhanced alien species in this region are of particular concern to the civilian populace. Do not approach under any circumstances. All attempts should be made to avoid contact with these life forms. This is a message. It's a warning. Let's go on a reaper spree. Enemies down. Slice and dice every snake in sight. Got him. Target disabled. We're decreasing in damage every time, but we're still killing everything, so... Neutralized. 
This is just... This is just nuts. And of course, I, I get... Uh, I get implacable, still. Take out this one last snake. Oh, I sure hope so. Nope. But like I said, implacable. So it doesn't matter. Moving out. <laughs> I mean, uh, d did you see how many snakes that I, I can't even count how many snakes <laughs> went down. One at a time. Don't make me bet. I can't even count how I many for how many snakes that I just outright obliterated in that string. I should have kept a count while I was going, because that was hilarious. Zoom, dead. 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 Moving to designated coordinates. Oh Lord, they come. Oh, they did. Kill confirmed. I believe this may be the last of them, Central. I am not detecting any additional signatures. Understood. Let's take them out and find Ballin. Central, reading a massive drop in temperature directly ahead. Such a large discrepancy defies any natural explanation. Something tells me that won't be the worst of our problems, Doctor. Well, that's dead. My eyes are peeled. I just realized I have fan fire in Kefla. That's gonna be really great pretty soon. Alright. Let's get your running and gun in so I can move you a little further. Let's dance, boys. Let's dance. Put on your red shoes and dance the blues. Take this easy because I know it's coming. And I don't want to spark everything quite yet. A long run.
central up. Let's do this. Where the fun begins. This would be subject to Gamma. Fallen created a Viper King. Just what we needed. Make it toasty. It would seem Valen's creation. Stay alert. You missed because you're a fire position itself. No action to lightning hands. Fan fire. Okay then. I figured I would possibly get the Viper King here, but uh, I didn't think it would happen in literally one turn. Kefla the Killer Queen. Is clear. 
I expected that to go a little bit longer than it did. I'm glad I was able to take out the Viper King with Fanfire. I just didn't expect it to happen. <laughs> But I'll take it. Even now, our enemy lurks in the shadows, plotting to destroy all we have built, to return us to the chaos of the old world, only to gather. Can we oppose them? United in the Elder's love for us, we shall prevail, no matter the cost. Ad Advent spokesperson, you know, I just did you a favor. One by one, we're evening up the score, Commander. Good work out there. Because, you know... Valen basically created what could have been the Kwisatz Haderach of Vipers. And I stopped that before it started trouble. Commander. Having successfully recovered one of Dr. Valen's genetically modified test subjects, I am eager to begin conducting an autopsy as soon as possible. It is my hope that by following her own research notes, I will gain an even greater understanding of just how she managed to accomplish these rapid changes. Well, once we're done with the encrypted codex brain, I'll let you get right on it. Right now, though, Setting I got a radio relay to build. Our actions have succeeded, and the elders grow fearful. Yay, new, yay, additional resistance contact. Let's go promote Anna to Major. Commander, our ring facility is currently idle. If we have the soldiers to spare, we should deploy them on a covert action with the Resistance. Modicate your memories, Bradford. We literally just finished a covert op. Central, Commander, excellent. My analysis of the fragmented codex data is almost complete. The information I've uncovered so far outweighs the loss of the Shadow Chamber, as you'll see. Is that an elder? Haven't seen one in at least a decade. Yes, and I believe I now understand why. The elders appear to be afflicted with an aggressive form of tissue degeneration. Rapid muscular atrophy, to a degree I had not even thought possible. So they're dying. Sounds like our job just got a whole lot easier. As with most things involving this adversary, it's never quite that simple. The elders have been aggressively searching for a cure to their condition for centuries. Each time they encountered a new species, they procured what genetic information and material they required and moved on to the next world. Until now. I believe they found something in us. 
something important enough to cause them to take root. A cure? Not that I can determine. Several key files were previously deleted as part of something called the Avatar Directive. Avatar. We need those files. Were I to gain access to a fully functioning codex, I might be able to recover them. Or blow the entire ship to hell this time around. I didn't say I needed the creature here, Bradford. I am confident I could access the unit remotely, provided your soldiers can get close enough to it in the field without destroying it first. That we can arrange, Doctor. New objective added. So we've got yet another new uh, story objective. To Skulljack and Codex. We're ready to move when you are, Commander. I've updated our objectives based on the latest information. Greetings, Commander. We have no Shadow Project. It's available. So, uh... Although it had been years since let's I... Let's take care of our autopsy. I found the process returned to me quite naturally. I am intrigued by the idea... Two days, and we're about to have the supply drop. I have made a number of interesting discoveries, Commander. Despite an extensive study of Dr. Valen's research report, I have yet to discover how she came to acquire such an impressive understanding of the processes involved in the editing and manipulation of alien genetic material. I will begin our research immediately. All right, hey, Commander. Let, let's head to the proving ground and let's get us that snack suit. This ship who feels the least bit sorry to hear the elders are dying off. If anything, morale probably got a boost once word spread outside of the senior staff. We course, need malaria. There's always a catch. They've always got a scheme, and I get the impression we're going to end up part of their cure, whether we like it or not. Got an urgent communication coming in for you now, Commander. I had high hopes for the Resistance under your leadership, Commander. And you have outdone yourself. Chosen are all dead. What is our hidden event? Major breakthrough on the Avatar project. Definitely want to stop that. The others, again, don't matter. Avatar project. Project progress. Ah, like the idea of that. Let's get me another Colonel Sharpshooter. Let's send our Phantom Thief along with her. My kind will do whatever is needed. Finish that radio. And let's go get those supplies. Avenger plotting new course. It's right where we want to be anyway. Our next major thing is going to be to take care of that black site data, I think. Let's get our money first. And actually, I'm kind of curious to see if the black market Avenger may have some malaria cores. They do not. In fact, I don't see anything that I want right now. So, 
Again, if it goes underground, I'm not worried. So I think we'll go ahead and cut things off here. And then we'll go take out the Black Site data coordinates. See you then. Way to go.